I'm going to show you how to catch all nine new bug snacks from the mine snacks mod to complete block those quest. So let's get started. First up is the pig, which you can see right here is near the entrance. The thing about the pig, you're not really going to be able to catch it in a standard snack trap. So we are going to use the lunch pad trip shot combo. So we've scanned him to see his path. I'm going to put the lunch pad here, trip shot there. Easy stun, easy capture. <laughs> Next up is the bee. You can see the bee right there. It is very loud. We're going to go ahead and catch that. You could try to get it with a trip shot. You'd have to be kind of precise, though. We could put the lunch trap here and the trip shot there. And then once it hits the trip shot, it's vulnerable. Easy capture. <laughs> But there is another way. If you go over here, you can gather some honey, which is one of the five new sauces in the Mind Snacks mod. So we're going to put a snack trap down here, and we're going to cover it in some honey. Personally, I think this is a much easier way to catch the bee. The bee will fly into the honey trap. Okay, or it'll fly, like, right on top of it. Go in the trap this time. Okay, that still looked like on top, but whatever works. Next up is the dolphin. What the heck are you doing? All right, well, the derpy dolphin is actually extremely easy to capture. As you can see from the skin, it hates everything, but it's fine. You don't even really need to worry about what it likes. Just put the trap in its way and capture. Just like that. Easy. Next up is the silverfish. You can find this silverfish in this Minecraft forest over here. Head like towards the portal-ish and wait a little bit and you should see the silverfish patrolling this path. Now there's a few ways we can catch this little critter. It is pretty fast but it is actually capturable in a snack trap. So since we already have some honey from before we're gonna go ahead and put some honey on the trap. I'm gonna wait for it to get a little bit closer first. This one has a bit of a longer patrol route. All right get ready. Easy capture. So that's one way you could do it. We're going to go ahead and release it, and I'm going to demonstrate that you can also capture it using a trip shot. So we're going to go ahead and put a lunch pad right here. Now, it is very, very small, so you need to try to aim the trip shot as low as possible. Bam. And you can capture it that way. Next up is the fox. So we're leaving the forest area, the house, and we're going towards the snow. And you can see the fox is just walking around. Now, you could just leave a trap here and wait for it to show up. It's not going to be afraid of the trap or anything like that. You can see that works. Easy capture. It will go inside the bush if you scare it, either by doing something dumb like I just did, or if you walk up close to it. But you can see it also really loves fish and rotten flesh. Rotten flesh is, is not as close as the fish. The fish is literally right here in this cave. So just go over to this cave, grab the fish, and then I'm going to put the trap over here, and I'm going to cover it with fish. As you can see, the fox loves it. Goes into the trap. Easy capture. <laughs> The other four are underground, so we're going to go ahead and enter the mine right here. And you can also get rotten flesh off of the piglin. We'll need that for the bat mine snack later. And then we're going to go ahead and enter here, not there. That leads back to the forest. Go deeper into the cave right here. And then right here, we're going to find the spider. You can see it doesn't really like or hate anything. I Actually, I take it back. It hates you. <laughs> so you can't actually capture this with a trap. Kind of like the pig. It just doesn't really fit in the trap. So what you need to do is use the trip shot combo. I'm going to take the lunch pad and we're going to put the trip shot on top of it and spider could you like move okay that works too i guess easy spider capture now we go deeper in the mine we've got three more mine snacks to go in this cave area right here once you enter the warped forest region there is a bat as you can see it loves apples and it loves rotten flesh well like i said we could grab some rotten flesh from that piglin there there's also one right here we're going to put a snack trap down and we're going to put some rotten flesh on it don't bounce off of it. You catch so easily when I'm not recording. There we go. That is just one way. Another way you can catch him, if you prefer, you can just put the lunch pad trip shot. Honestly, do trip shot OP. It just works for everything. It's so good. <laughs> oh, jeez. We're going to enter the ice cave region, and we're going to capture the polar bear first. Now, be very careful about the polar bear. It is aggressive like the spider, but unlike the spider, not only can it hit you and launch you, but it can also freeze you. So because it is an icy bug snack, we need to use fire in this. The easiest way by far, just put the trip shot on top of this thing. That's okay. And since it transfers the fire and it stuns, it's a two for one special. Bam! And then you can just grab it as it is. And last but not least, we have the adorable Axolotl, who for some reason also hates everything. But this is very easy to catch. Just put the trap in and bam. And that's how to catch all nine new bug snacks from the Mind Snacks mod. Then all you have to do after that is feed the Mind Snacks to Block Dough here. The quest will be complete and you'll gain access to new hats for your bug snacks and new furniture. If this video helped, please leave a like and subscribe. It helps out a lot. And let me know what else you'd like to see. Have a great day and give me all your cookies.